if you're ever camping alone in the forest, if you ever hear animal sounds that are not quite right at night, you get up and leave. Because if they're getting close to you and you don't want, they don't want you to hear human sounds, they'll start communicating in animal voices. And so, yeah, there's a few guys that were out there. They started hearing like sounds that were just a little bit off. You know, you hear like a laughing falcon sound. And he was like, that doesn't actually sound like a... And then he heard the capuchins from different areas. And usually capuchin monkeys are going to be all together in one spot. And he heard it from different directions. And he was just like, he said he climbed into the river and crawled like a turtle out of that. He said he went for hours and just to escape. I can't, I can't believe that we lost this video, but this guy had a, he had a video when they, they had made contact and the tribe was there and they had their arrows and they're pointing their arrows across the beach. And the guys in the community are trying to send them a canoe filled with bananas because they're like, look, we're friends. And they're trying to make an offering, like stop the killing. So they tried to send them a thing and you can hear the tribes and they're talking using monkey calls. And we know what a capuchin monkey sounds like, but they're using these calls in the video on the beach and they're like communicating with each other.